Hey, Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome to the Potter Collector Channel, where we are a community of collectors. And happy Easter to each and every one of you. Today we're doing an unboxing, something very fun and different, something I've never done before, and that is a box swap. And what a box swap is, or some sort of swap, is where a bunch of people get together, everyone is randomly given one of the other people, and then they send a box or an item or whatever to that particular person, and everybody gets something. It's just this big, fun group swap event. Well, our friends Melissa and Christian, Melissa from Geeking Out with Melly Mel, and Christian from MC Dorks or Mick Dorks, started a Easter box swap that they call the Golden Egg Hair. Harry Potter Easter Swap. This is the third annual one that they've done, and I was happy that I was able to participate this year. A bunch of other great creators and collectors and Harry Potter fans have also joined in, so check the description down below if you'd like to see a list of everyone who participated this year. So I have no idea who sent me this box. I know who I sent a box to, but don't know who I received a box from. So we're gonna find out together right now. So there were some requirements when it came to this box swap. The budget had to be no less than $75. There had to be one golden egg related item in the box. It could have been a pin or jewelry or a figurine, Funko Pop, piece of art, piece of apparel, something golden egg related. There had to be one Harry Potter related headwear item, headband or a hat, one Harry Potter themed pin, one and one candle so those were the requirements so i'm excited to see what they picked out and sent along first of all let's take a look at this box look at this golden box decorated with some golden accenting here a hogwarts sticker on this side very fun what is going to be on the inside now i will also post in the description down below the unboxing video for actually we've already all posted the videos so i can tell you who i sent my box to i sent my box to a fellow harry potter creator in the united kingdom Kaylee Christensen. If you want to see the items that I sent to her and her unboxing, check the description down below. And then also within that list of fellow creators, you can go to their YouTube channels and check out what they received in their unboxing videos. All right, here we go. The box has been opened. Oh, I think I see a dragon, like a dragon plush. I don't have this guy. Hey, awesome. This is from the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. The Hungarian Horn Tail, which I do not have. Well done, dragon. Well done, whoever sent this to me. We're gonna find out who sent it right here. Or we're gonna read this after we open the box. But look at this, we have the official Wizarding World of Harry Potter Hungarian Horn Tail plush, which I do not have. This is awesome, I love it. And look at those golden wings, like this is perfect. Thank you very much, whoever sent this to me, who I will find out, I will find out who you are in a second. The Wizarding World of Harry Potter has like, Incredible plush creatures, like incredible plush. All right, we have a gold box in here. Da, 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 da. What is in the golden egg golden box? Oh, that's beautiful, look. Got a platform nine and three quarters Hogwarts Express sticker. What's that? That's cool. I don't know what it is, but it's cool. Uh, we've got a dragon egg sticker fun we have our golden egg i think something's on the inside i'm gonna pull everything out <gasps> golden egg creamy hazelnut chocolates perfect <gasps> my favorite reese's peanut butter cups not just reese's peanut butter cups reese's peanut butter cup eggs perfect day for reese's peanut butter cup eggs all right we've got something here and we've got another sticker the triwizard cup very appropriate for this box swap there's a lot of great stuff in here but i noticed this like look at this isn't that cool this like styrofoam wall i really like this <laughs> like what what is this that's like the coolest styrofoam thing i've ever seen i'm going right for an egg like i'm going right for an easter egg like right now because your boy loves himself some reese's peanut butter cups Mm. Peanut butter happy dance, peanut butter happy dance. Reese's peanut butter cups always taste different. Whether it's a cup or it's an egg or it's a whatever, it doesn't always taste the same. Today, it kind of tastes like the peanut butter Girl Scout cookies tagalongs, which I love. So, can't go wrong with these right now. Mm. Let's open this first, this gold bag. And inside, 
there's something wrapped up. What's it gonna be? A pin, a Wizarding World of Harry Potter pin. Shut up. Oh my goodness. Okay, so now I don't know if whoever sent this knew how much I wanted this pen. So to receive this is very exciting. One, because I've wanted it, and I've actually mentioned in videos how much I love it. But two, well done, dragon! It's the Ukrainian Iron Belly on top of Gringotts, where anytime she breathes fire, I yell, well done, dragon! That's so fun! Thank you so much for this. It's such a cool pen, like an amazing pen. Look at the detail on that. So I don't know if you Bought it because of the Well Done Dragon thing, or because I mentioned in videos before how much I loved this pin. Either way, it was a very good selection. Thank you. What's this? This is wrapped up too. Mm, that peanut butter in my mouth is so good. The Charmed Castle. That's what this box says. Illuminate happiness. And it says it's not a toy, so we're not gonna be playing with it. Oh, cute! Oh man, is this dragons? Okay, so this is a windmill for a candle, and it looks like there are... Fun! Okay, so it's Goblet of Fire. So it's two dragons, two Hungarian horn tails, and then there are two Harry Potters on broomsticks, and the dragon is gonna chase Harry Potter around the candle, and it's one of those windmills where you put it on top of the candle and the flame makes it rotate. So I'm gonna put that aside for a second because I think this might be a candle. The Whomping Willow candle. What's it smell like? What does the Whomping Willow smell like? Musky, kind of musty, kind of woody, I would guess. Ooh, it's nice. It's um, it's a little piney, musty. It's like wood, pine, and must mustiness. Really nice. Like, I don't want to call it Christmassy because it's it's pine. It smells like pine, but it doesn't smell necessarily like Christmas. It's a really, really nice woodwick also. It's a woodwick candle. Really nice scent. So then what you do is you pop this on top of here. This goes in like so. And this goes on top like so. And then you hang your characters on the windmill. This is adorable. That's so fun. I've not seen this one. This is really, really cool. Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> Inflamare. It's just like magic. All right, let's put the windmill on top here and watch dragon spin. Isn't that so fun? That is so fun. I'm gonna keep the candle lit so we can get that scent in this library. Oh, let's give these a try, these golden eggs. Creamy hazelnut experience. That is an experience. All right, we're gonna save the golden egg for last and we're gonna open this up next. This is a hat. This is awesome. Who are you? I wanna know who you are because this was such a thoughtful, creative box that you sent me. It's a hat, guys. It's a custom hat that says, well done, dragon! <laughs> this is in this really cool green color too. So like you made this. This is really, really, really cool. Like really cool. And the thing I love about it is not only is it just Goblet of Fire themed, because the Golden Egg is Goblet of Fire. But if you look at this patch, it looks like an entry to the Triwizard Tournament. So the edges are burned. It looks like, you know, someone wrote their name on it. In this case, Well Done Dragon. I love it. I absolutely love it. And this is perfect for the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. So whoever you are, thank you very much for this. I can't wait to find out who you are. All right, let's open this up and then we do get to find out who you are. And the candle, by the way, smells really, really good burned too. Mm. All right, the golden egg. What's in the golden egg? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> it's not actually screaming. All right, we have a pin. We've got a pin. What is that? I've never seen this before. That is an incredible pin. It's the top of the golden egg. It's the lock of the golden egg. Look at this, it rotates too. That is a genius, genius pin. Where is this from? That's incredible. I've never seen this pin before. I love this. So the pin design, like it's just really beautifully done. The feathers in the back 
are a shiny gold and more metallic gold. And then the front feathers and the owl are more of a less shiny gold. So there's a really nice contrast between the two of them when they've been separated like that. Love the theme, love that you stuck with Goblet of Fire. Eggs, you know, golden eggs, more golden eggs. So much thought put into this. Thank you very much, whoever you are. We're gonna find out right now. We are gonna find out this very moment. So the other thing I wanted to mention was um, at the beginning of the swap, we were all given questions to fill out based off of our preferences of candy or you know things we don't want to receive, things we might want to receive. So what's nice is it wasn't like just completely blind. And then when we were given the name of the person who we were going to send a box to, their preferences were also sent along to us. So just a really fun system. All right, we've got a great card here, the Mina Lima Slytherin Crest card. Love this card very much. Sarah from World of Enchantment. Sarah, thank you so much, so much. This is so cool. Like, I don't know if you did this on purpose, but it kind of looks like the rocks that, you know, the, it's it's like a, um, what, do they, what do you call this? A, uh, like a diorama. You know, I, I could set up a little diorama with, with that, that foam. All right, let's read the note. Hope you enjoyed the box. I absolutely enjoyed the box. I decided to play on the golden egg slash dragon theme. Well, you nailed it. In case you were wondering where the items came from, the dragon pin and stuffed animal is from Wizarding World at Universal. I got nervous when you posted a Universal merchandise video and hoped you didn't buy these. No, I did not, but it's in that video that I mentioned how much I loved this pin. The candles from the Etsy shop, Heavenly Scent Candle Co. The website says the scent has the following. Top notes of moss, eucalyptus, and willow. Middle notes, sandalwood, amber, fir needles. And the bottom notes, patchouli, musk, and earthy. So I got some of those. Yeah, I mean, that's what it smells like. Like, it, it's, it's, it was well done. Really nice candle. Since your scent preference mentioned pine, musk, and earthy, I thought it would be a good fit. It's a perfect fit. It's an absolutely perfect fit. It smells like a, a forest, but like not a Christmas forest, like a forest, which is perfect. I also included a candle carousel of the dragon chasing Harry. The candle carousel is from the Etsy shop, The Charmed Castle. The spinning owl clasp pin is the golden egg related mystery item. It's a discontinued pin from Looney Love Goods. I thought it was so unique that they turned the clasp of the golden egg into a pin. Not to mention it's fun to spin. Yes. Absolutely brilliant that they did this. I'm blown away by this pin. And good find too, holy cow. With the hat, I knew I wanted to do something with Well Done Dragon. I've always wanted to start embroidering hats, so I figured it was the perfect opportunity to start. It's so cool going to the Universal Studios and hearing people scream the phrase, knowing you started the trend. It's very cool and very exciting anytime that I hear someone yell, Well Done Dragon. It was a pleasure putting the box together for you. You were a big inspiration in me starting my channel. My first video, which is no longer up due to poor video quality was an unboxing from one of your Potter Collector sales. Needless to say, I was stoked when I saw who I was making the box for. I hope you liked everything. Happy Easter. Sincerely, Sarah Carley from World of Enchantment. Sarah, you know I love creativity and detail. You nailed it on the head. Perfect. Love the hat. The detail here of the burned edges, which I'm assuming is supposed to look like an entry to the Triwizard Tournament. The candle smells fantastic. Love it all. Thank you so much, and also to you, happy Easter. I'm gonna eat this last egg, I, so I ate one off camera. So I did eat all four, but I'm gonna eat this last one right now. A big thank you to Melissa and Christian for starting this really fun golden egg Harry Potter Easter swap. A very happy Easter to each and every one of you watching. And I want to remind you, if you are interested in seeing what some of the other creators have unboxed, check the description down below. You will find a list of the participating creators. If you have any questions about Harry Potter or collecting, feel free to leave a comment down below. You can also join the Potter Collector community on Instagram at the Potter Collector. On Twitter, now known as X at Potter Collector, or on Discord. The official Potter Collector Discord is linked down below. Now it's time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting. Thank you so much for watching, and if you're new here, welcome. We cover all things Harry Potter on the Potter Collector channel, like books, merchandise reviews, unboxings, Wizarding World of Harry Potter videos, and more. If you would like to subscribe, you can click right here. You can also check out a previously posted video right around here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter, feel free to leave a comment down below. I am happy to help. But for now, I must go. We'll see you next time. Whoa, where'd he go?